He made those just for his kids' birthday parties that took off and they cleaned and they used flowers. And in this country, they had little cardboard boxes that they put straw in. And some guy came up with the idea of putting river rocks in there. They boxed them, they called them pet rocks. And they sold them for $10 a piece. The guy's a multi-millionaire. And everybody bought a pet rock because it never needed to be walked, fed, or burnt. Okay? And you look at you think of inventions like that or thought or little things that came up like that. People have made millions and millions of dollars off. Here he comes up with what every country in the world relies on. AC voltage. And the more we become electrically, electronically and electrically driven, we rely more and more on him day after day after day. Okay, so pretty bizarre when you think of it in that context. Okay? We had an ice storm here in 2006. We put about four inches of ice on branches. It was stamped in branches that stick around with their toothpicks. The leaves were still on the trees, and the leaves froze, collected all the ice, and pulled trees and power lines down. It was something, like something out of the movies, the city of Buffalo. It was very eerie, very scary. People were living off of generators and fireplaces. Because even if you had gas heat, you couldn't use it because you didn't have a blower wheel to throw it to push it through the house. People were living off of without electric, and it really put a people, uh, it gave people a strong appreciation for electricity. And like I said, it's a shame the poor guy died broke after coming up with something like that. Okay, our next journey is the Cave of the Wind. 